State and county officials reach an apparent solution for a pair of problem bridges in southern Indiana. Lowered weight limits had Greene County officials worried truckers with heavy loads would have trouble finding alternate ways to cross the White River. On News 10's Mike Grant reports, the state has another option to keep trucks on the highway and reduce the strain on the bridges. The bridges on State Highway 57 at Newberry are old and battered. They're scheduled to be replaced in 2013, but state officials say the latest inspection of them found problems needing some immediate attention. There were some issues that were brought to light that they wanted to review a little more thoroughly. So that is when um, they came to us and asked us to reduce the weight limit. The state dropped the limit to 14 tons. The plan was to keep big semis off of the bridges. County officials say they understood the reasons why the state wanted to put weight limits on these two bridges. But at the same time, it raised concerns that truck traffic that couldn't go over here might turn to the local county roads for another way around. We've, we've received several calls from concerned citizens, taxpayers, local officials, and again, you know, we're working to cooperate with them. The new solution is being put into place. Now the state plans to limit traffic to a single lane through the bridges. Stoplights are being installed to control the traffic and keep trucks running the same highway route. By reducing the amount of traffic on the structure at one time, especially conflicting traffic coming toward one another, um, that will help um, any of the strained areas. And save county roads from any beating they take from additional heavy loads. In Newberry, I'm Mike Grant, News 10. The stoplights are expected to be activated in about two weeks.